good evening, good evening, mommies and daddies, grandparents, teachers, and everybody else. This is Don, a.k.a. the Interactive Nanny, coming to you today from Interactive Nanny's World, where love and play are interacting. I am so, 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 so excited to be with you guys again this week. We have another cool topic that we're going to touch on tonight. This evening's topic is all about nursery rhymes, so this is mainly geared toward our our preschoolers, toddlers, um, early kindergarten age children, kindergarten through maybe second, third grade or so. Um, but it's all about nursery rhymes, and nursery rhymes actually help you in other areas. It's not just some little cutesy, rhymy something or another little ditty that we sing or we dance or we sing songs say word wise to it is actually really really important in the um learning and education of our little ones so we're going to talk about our nursery rhymes the topic of tonight's episode is nursery rhymes never get old and they really don't guys research and early literacy reveals that A host of of nursery rhymes can be and are quite instrumental in assisting our little ones in the ability to conquer pre-reading skills, which is very important. Literacy skills include phonological skills such as rhyme production, rhyme detection, rhyme additive, Phenomenal awareness, phoneme detection, and the repetition of consonant sounds in stressed parts of word groups. These factors help tr- held true for children with many different disabilities. This is all well and good for us as adults that want the best for our little heartbeats, but. If for the little ones, nursery rhymes are fun. They love them and they provide the warm, the warm fuzzies <laughs> and create nurturing experiences and memories throughout life. Nursery rhymes have been around for ages. I mean, generations, y'all. They, they've never gone away. Nursery rhymes also foster musical and other creative skills. Get those juices going, you know. The sing-song voice, the rhythm, the beat, the rhyming. Oh, my God, so much fun. For me, nursery rhymes are a necessity for a wonderful childhood. They make our little ones happy. Nursery rhymes create an all-smiles atmosphere. Sometimes we adults need to stop concentrating on the big picture and just look at it through the eyes of our little heartbeats. Sometimes we as adults need to just join in. When they start singing the nursery rhymes, we join in on the fun as well. Sometimes you can actually make up your own nursery rhymes. I mean, it'll help them. You can take, like if they're in the age group or grade group, as for school-wise, where they're doing um, spelling words or they're learning about consonants and vowel sounds. You can take... The, the school lesson turn it into a nursery rhyme and they'll get it probably way faster than you just sitting there struggling trying to actually just teach them what the lesson is turn it into a fun nursery rhyme they'll remember it if they're taking spelling words I mean doing if they're doing spelling words turn it into a, turn the spelling words into some kind of fun nursery rhyme some kind of sing song something They'll get it, they'll retain it. When it's time to take that spelling test, they got it. All they have to do is is, is think about the nursery rhyme that you created with them as their parent. And it's all good. And it'll also help with their stress level if they are one of those children that have test anxiety. I mean, nursery rhymes, they can do so many things. If you're outside playing, you can draw like the little hopscotch board on the sidewalk. And while you're jumping doing hopscotch, you can actually be singing some kind of little nursery rhyme and, and turn hopscotch into a whole different game. Um, you can do so much with nursery rhymes. Nursery rhymes, in some form, form or fashion, can also help with like math skills. 
if you if you're at the age where you're working with word problems, which this is probably for some of the older children, if you're working with word problems, make it into a nursery rhyme of some sort or some kind of rhyming sentence. That I promise you, they will get it. So nursery rhymes are really they're not just for entertainment. Nursery rhymes are important. Nursery rhymes help. Nursery rhymes matter, guys. So this is Don, aka an inactive nanny, coming to you all this evening with, and letting us know as adults we sometimes we need a reminder that nursery rhymes never get old. Um, so next week we'll either be touching on another topic or there may be story time. But until then, this is Don, aka the inactive nanny. Signing off from Inactive Nanny, Inactive Nanny's World, where love and play are interactive. And I thank you guys. If you have anybody that have little ones, have them listen and subscribe. Share, 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 share. Until next week, see you guys. Talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.